Now, Elton, Ben Simmons, without question, is the best player in the country. And, and I'm he's, sure, he's sure you best, agree with that. He's the best talent of, in the country. Well, that's the best not, player. No, there's a difference between talent and play. Okay, how's that? Huh? We see guys that can jump out of the gym and, 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 and shoot but can't dribble. But guys can have talent. Okay. Okay. But there's you got to be a well-rounded player. LeBron James is a well-rounded player. Ben, there are a lot of great ben athletes. Ben Simmons is a well-rounded player. He can shoot. He's, he can rebound. He can dribble. If he was maybe not play defense like a lot of those guys right, in college, but right. he can do it all. No, I think he's. I do think he's the best talent. You know, I, I'm a hold off. I, I'm always shy about giving a freshman. <laughs> Right, and saying a freshman is the best player in the country. Come on, this is not the that's 70s just, or the 60s. Yeah, well, I'm from play. the 70s and the 60s, and I'm, I'm, I agree they can play, but I'm not going to give a freshman best player in the game off of 10 games. Okay, so I'm sure you're okay. going to give it to Don for Providence. Uh, I like Don. Yeah, I'm sure you give it to upperclassmen. I like Don. Handle I, like, I like Wayne Seldon at Kansas. Why do you like him? Huh? Because he's an all-around player on a winning team. <laughs> How about that? Okay. All right. So we agree. <laughs> Simmons is not on a winning team, but he's definitely a well-rounded player. But um, a talent. Best player in the game. <laughs> There's uh, guys that played at Cleveland State. Uh, right. Certainly they're not the best players in the country, but it's really interesting how they're doing well since they left Cleveland State for this this rule that I think is crazy. But yeah, but, and I, but how are they doing? Yeah, it's it's amazing. Last night, uh, four to five played, okay, and the five players combined. If you throw in uh, Anton Grady, who's just coming back at Wichita State, here's what they did last night for for Louisville. Trey Lewis scored 17 points. Okay, for Louisville, they won. Michigan State, Brent Forbes scored 32 points. 32 points. 32 points, and they won. Uh, Wichita State, like I said, Grady is averaging nine points. He didn't play. Providence, Junior LaMamba, he scored 11 points. They won, okay? UNLV, uh, uh, Ike Nwamu, okay, 16 points. That's 85 points combined that Cleveland State is missing. People wonder, uh, you know, they, they really dismiss the fact of the quality and level of player that – that, that Cleveland State lost and why they are struggling the way they're struggling this year, although they've won two straight going into uh, their game against Bowling Green. But that said, that is why, A, they're struggling, and B, people were really looking forward to this team, Cleveland State, being a challenger this year uh, uh, with all these guys being seniors.